Today's Bible study is titled Walk Worthy of God. Previously, Paul has spoken of how he and Silas did not conduct themselves as they shared the message of God's grace. Now, in what is verses 7 to 12 of 1 Thessalonians 2, Paul describes the way they did. But we were gentle among you, even as a nurse cherisheth her children, so being affectionately desirous of you, we were willing to have imparted unto you, not the gospel of God only, but also our own souls, because you were dear unto us. For ye remember, brethren, our labor and travail, for laboring night and day, because we would not be chargeable unto any of you, we preached unto you the gospel of God. Ye are witnesses, and God also, how holily and justly and unblameably we behaved ourselves among you that believe, as ye know how we exhorted and comforted and charged every one of you, as a father doth his children, that ye would walk worthy of God, who hath called you unto his kingdom and glory. 1 Thessalonians 2 verses 7 to 12. Taking a closer look, we find the manner in which they conducted themselves to be gentle, as a nurse, likely a reference to a nursing mother, though would lovingly care for her children, and affectionately. Further Paul notes that they imparted to them not just the gospel of God but also their own souls, the very essence of their beings, because the believers of Thessalonica were that dear to them. After this he describes their labor and concern for them, included earning their own living so they would not be a burden to them as they preached the gospel of God and his heavenly kingdom and glory. And as for their behavior among them, it was holily and justly and unblameably, as they exhorted and comforted and charged every one of them like a father to beloved children. And the goal for all of this was that the believers of Thessalonica would walk worthy of God who had called them. And that is the exhortation, the comfort, and the charge of rightly divided scripture to the body of Christ today. Namely, that believers would walk worthy of God who has made them and, by believing the truths of them in Christ, would see the Holy Spirit produce such a walk in them and works through them. Believer, because you are, in Christ, a walk worthy of God is your reasonable expectation. Thank you for listening to this Bible study today. God bless you.